everyone. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. Please consider subscribing. Um, I'm just jumping on real quick before I have to go get my kids from school. Um, I just got a box in the mail from Scentsy. So um, I'm going to get into this. I think I know what's in here. Um, I think I have a customer order and then some things of mine that I've been waiting on. And um, we've had kind of some delayed shipping so i've been waiting for this for a while so let's get into this um, so okay yep this is my order and my friend's order so let's unpack miles and miles of scentsy paper which my dog will probably jump into here in a second. We're all geared up for Halloween. So I treated myself to a birthday present, this t-shirt or sweatshirt rather. I got it at Maurice's. I, they actually had my size. I couldn't believe it. I bought a brand new uh, wristband for my watch. And then I just got my dog groomed the other day and they put this adorable little handkerchief on him. Every time I pick him up, they have a different themed uh, hanky that they put on him. Say hi. And we got him a, a Halloween collar. So say hi. Look, there you are. He's not into it. He just wants to be here. He's a little lover. So let's get into what I got. Um, first off, there is a warmer. And it looks like there's some pen mark on it. I don't know why there's pen mark on the box, but um, my customer wanted this Deja Mu warmer. She's been thinking about this for a while and apparently she went ahead and just told me to order it. Um, also part of her order is the Pink Awareness bundle. And I have already gotten this for myself, although I have not warmed any of these. Um, all of them smell very pretty. I can't remember which one was my favorite out of the bunch, but I'm gonna go ahead and sniff these again since they're right in front of my face. Um, turn up the pink, which one of these is, maybe it was this one. Um, please don't chew on my box. Um, I believe this is what the, the Scentsy Buddy is scented in. The, the scent pack that comes with it is Turn Up the Pink, I believe. Don't chew on my box. Um, I think I can. This is probably the one that smelled like Aloha Orchid. Yeah, I think this one smells a lot like Aloha Orchid, which I liked it, but it was not one of my favorites. It was just very, very sharp to me. Um, positively pink. This one smells like maybe plum. This one very much reminds me of uh, Sanderson Sisters. Perfect, perfectly Wicked. Not quite the same, but very, very similar. So if that's one that was a Scentsy Heartbreak, maybe try Positively Pink. I To me, they smell very similar. Um, pink Spreads Hope. That's the fourth bar in this collection. This one smells very rosy, and I will probably like warming this one. Um, I want to warm them so I can get a good idea of what I may want to put in my club. I don't think that you can put these in club until November 1st, though. This smells kind of soapy, like, like a soap that I've had before, kind of like maybe something that my grandma would have sent in a care package from UPS. Oh. And part of the, well, that's not cool. Part of it broke off in there. Might have to switch her out with my bar. Um, yeah, this smells like, maybe it's like the English rose soap or something. But this smell, it, it smells delightful. I do like it. I like florals and fresh. Um, I've noticed here recently as I've been trying to warm through my holiday collection bars, and then my, um, the Disney bar, the Frightfully De Delightful. 
look, you guys. My husband hated that bar, and I loved it. I loved Gimme Candy, which it reminds me a lot of. My husband hated it. He kept turning off my warmer, and guess what he did this time? He kept turning off my warmer. So I just, I don't know what his scent preferences are, but I've got to guess they're probably like mine, probably woodsy, fresh, and floral, because he is not having any of the bakery. So I don't know what to do. I'm kind of beside myself because every bar that I've warmed here lately, he hates. So in order to kind of keep the peace, I've been trying to find something that he liked. I was really bummed out um, because all the bars that I've been warming, he just, he just did not like. He'd come in and say, oh, what are you warming in here? And then the last bar that I warmed, I had high hopes for, I didn't like. And that was Rum Pum Plum. I don't know what it is. There's some funk in that bar, but I, I don't know what I'm gonna do with the rest of the bar. Um, give it away. I, I mean, I hate to give it to somebody else who may not like it, but I'm probably not gonna warm any more of it. Probably not even gonna make samples of it because we're going into the holiday season and I don't know how much longer the harvest scents will be available. So, I don't know, we'll see. Um, I've got, uh, just wanna make sure I got the right number here. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, yep. Six 25 watt pink bulbs. And I have a party to close out and I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to use some of my product credit to get some more of these. Um, she wanted three and then for some reason, they don't come packaged as three, but you have to buy three. So I don't know. They're probably not going to have these for very long. I don't imagine it's something that they're going to have permanently, even though I think they probably should because I think they would sell a crap ton of pink bulbs. But um, I'm probably going to use some of my product credit to get some more bulbs just to have on hand because, I mean, if they're not going to have them, once they're gone, they're gone. Where else are you going to get them? I've never seen pink warmer bulbs anywhere else. So um, so part of that was my order. Three bulbs were for me. And then the Scents of the Season collection, this is for me. I really hope that I like these because we totally struck out on the last ones. And I kind of wish that all these were new scents because I have had Homestead Holiday. Um, I don't know that I bought the Consultant Advance Kit when Peppermint Rush was out. It just smells like peppermint to me. A lot of people say it smells like toothpaste. I'm not interested in having my whole house smell like toothpaste, but I will try it. It smells uh, it smells like a candy cane to me, so we will try it. Um, Homestead Holiday, I have a customer who absolutely loves this scent, so I'm gonna tell her if you want any of these, you should probably stick them in a club. It, I know a lot of people rave over this scent, but on cold, it really just doesn't even smell that great to me. I did have some bars and I sold them to her, so I never actually got to warm this. So I might do this one just for myself. Uh, that's Homestead Holiday. Um, let's see, Sugar Plumberry. Oh, this smells nice. But then I thought rum pum pum sm smelled nice too until I warmed it. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna be heartbroken if I don't like this because I at least wanna like some of the holiday bars. Um, frosted white pine, I do love tree scents, so I have no doubts I'll like this one. This one, not necessarily reminds me of icicles and evergreen but it has that kind of lighter tree scent because icicles and evergreen was not overpowering this just smells really nice to me i like tree scents i know some people choke on them but i actually love tree scents and uh icicles and evergreen my scentsy heartbreak i did not put it in club i did not buy any bars last year because I had had the scent and warmer of the month come to me when it was icicles and evergreen and I never bought any more. That's my bad. 
and I've seen it in clearance a couple times. I've had it in my cart and it disappeared. So that's my boohoo. Caramel praline cake. Now see, this is something that I think I would like, but my husband is gonna hate it. And I know he will because it has that sweet, sweet bakery note. Yeah, I don't think he's going to like this. It doesn't smell like frightfully delightful, but it has that that kind of cloyingly sweet, sickening sweet, maybe not candy, but just very sweet. I'll try it, but I guarantee you he's going to shut my warmer off. I know I can I can see it before it even happens. He's going to shut my warmer off. Excuse me. I really like this. And I am not, I'm not huge on bakery, but this smells really nice. But I probably won't be able to buy anymore because my husband's going to hate it so much. And I know before I even put it in the warmer that he's going to throw a fit and shut off my warmer. So those are the five uh, scents of the holiday collection. And they come in this really cute box. Don't quote me because I don't know if you have to buy them as a collection or if you can buy them separately. I don't know. Um, I know you can put them in clubs separately, but if you can buy them separately as far as just like a, a single purchase, I don't know. So you'll have to defer to the website for that. I really like this. I think I'm really going to like warming this. It's not necessarily club worthy because my club is growing and I have to watch that. So this smells really nice. This looks like it has maybe plum and cranberry. That's what's on the cover or on the clamshell, what it looks like to me anyway. I'm really hoping I like that. Um, I have a warm homestead holiday but hopefully it warms differently than it smells on cold because I'm just not a huge fan on cold. And I wish I would have warmed some of this, but I'm glad that my customer got some good use out of it. So there's that. I mean, I'm not heartbroken that I sold her those. I just would like to know what it smells like warming before I go to warm it now. But... I will have to let her know that if she wants it, now is the time. So those are the two collections that came in my order. Sense of the Season collection and Pink Awareness. Um, I'm not sure how long this particular collection is going to remain available. Um, it's been out for a little while. So um, October 1st probably is when it came out, I'm guessing. So that is my small haul. So I gotta get her stuff rounded up for her and out the door. And then, oh my gosh, you guys, I waited too long. I went to Dollar Tree or Dollar 25 Tree today to see if I could find some jack-o'-lantern lights for some pumpkins that we're gonna carve. I'm gonna have to order off Amazon. I can't find any. And the ones that I found at Walmart, I was not interested in. I want the little hockey puck ones that, um, that actually last and um the ones that i found that i really liked were like 15 dollars, but there were three of them and they would strobe or change colors and they had a little remote so i'm kind of excited but my only other thing that i found that i'm not even sure why i got it i got two of these known for the holidays because my kids are always going through cookies like crazy so I went ahead and got two of these. I thought for $1.25, uh, I'll do it. But they had a lot of gnome stuff at Dollar Tree. So if that's something that's up your alley, they've got all the Christmas stuff out. Um, very little Halloween stuff left, which is my bad again. But um, yeah, they had towels. They had little actual gnome. They are maybe like, I don't know, this tall. They had decor signage. Oh my gosh, all that good stuff. But this was my my big Dollar Tree purchase today was two of these. 
So if that's something that you like, you better get there and get the best selection. So that was my haul, guys. Um, I hope you like this video. If you do, please give it a like. Um, if you're new here, please consider subscribing. I would like to grow my channel. I love to share my Scentsy, my Scentsy adventure with you guys. Um, I have a set of the month coming. It should be here fairly quick because for some reason, the scent and warmer of the month, they always ship out really super lightning fast. I always get those right away, but regular orders tend to take a lot longer. And I, I don't know what the dynamic is behind that, but I think they pull on the 15th. So today is what the 19th. So, oh yeah, I bought a new watch face for my, uh, for my watch too. I haven't done that in years. I've just always had my, my earth is my default. And then I got my Hocus Pocus band and sorry, I'm having a squirrel moment, but yeah. So if you like this video, please give it a like, please consider subscribing. Thanks guys. And I'll see you in the next video.